prefer a natural body or a BBL? BBL. 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 Do you prefer natural bodies or BBL bodies? Natural. 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 Do you think men prefer? I don't know who is informing these, but we don't like that build a beer. We don't like that fake. Now, me personally, I've never came across a BBL, meaning I've never gotten some BBL cheeks. But I've heard through the grapevine that it feels like a muscle. It feels like she's flexing constantly. Now, you know, natural cheeks, they got some movement to it. You feel what I'm saying? They got some shake to it. They got a little wobble to it. Uh, BBL cheeks, it, it just, it don't appeal to me. Even when I used to go to the strip club, first of all, I'm cheap anyway. So I'm already not trying to spend no money on no dances. But if by, by any chance, you know, I become weak in the knees and I decide to get a dance, it's definitely not going to be from one of them strippers I got a BBL. One more thing I want to add, which is crazy to me. But did you guys know that BBL is like a form of status now? I was watching this video on YouTube and one of the people was like, yo, she not even popping. She don't even have a BBL. So BBLs are like getting a Birkin bag. You know how for us men, some of us, of course, we get a, a Mercedes or we get a BMW. It shows status. Ladies, we like natural, okay? We love natural. We like the way that thing break dance. You working on it. I like that for you. You should be working on that fucking hairline. <laughs> nah, my hair, my shit is straight. My that shit is pushed back. Whoever your shit barber straight. is, fuck you up. You're you like you fucking Ray me up right now. Why are you trying to hurt my feelings? Oh, Why are you going for your neck? You like Larry the Lobster. <laughs> <laughs> you just gonna play hard to get like that? I don't fuck with Hey, bro. You gotta way, come back at some point. No, you corny as then you got this nut ass Brooklyn jersey on. Now, how old are you? I'm 21. You 21 with fing acne. Hell yeah. Tighten the fuck up. That shit look bad. We need, to, we need to tighten up together. I'm cool. I don't want to tighten up with no nigga that 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 sh You working on it. I like that for you. You should be working. Bro, at some point, you got to defend yourself. Am I tripping? Ain't no way no heifer that look like Snuffleupagus with them fake ass eyelashes is coming at me without me coming back at her. Shit, I would have asked her to tug on her hair. Let me see if that shit stay on or if it's going to fall off. Ain't no way because I know that ain't her hair. I know that's weave. I know that's, that's weave. Come on, son. And you got that Brooklyn shirt on. You making this look bad. Y'all, I think I'm about to stop doing hair because I had a client book me and this man was so out of line. This man said, damn, this You said you was gonna stop doing head. I thought she was troubled. I think she was more troubled. My man ain't throwing no bread at her. That's crazy. You know what else be crazy? Cause my wife is an esthetician. She on her own business. But I be thinking about that. Me and her done had conversations before where I, you know, like dudes might come at her sideways. But it don't even be like the dudes that she give facials to. And she be like, yo, you know, you got me feeling weird or whatever. Cause I don't know the energy you're gonna come at me with if like. You catch a dude, like you see a dude talking to me. It could be about business. It could be about this. And I'm like, yo, no. Time out. And I, I'm pretty sure a lot of y'all can agree with me about this. I'm like, yo, anytime you, I've ever pressed you about something, it's because somebody give off a weird energy. If I was insecure, you wouldn't be able to do facials. Because you rubbing dudes faces all day. I don't never come at you about rubbing dudes faces. So it don't be that. Niggas give me scumbag energy. I'm, I'm on that. I'm pressing that. But... Yeah, man, if your girl is an esthetician, if your girl do nails, if your girl do hair, bro, folks, is, that's a, that's an opening, bro. That's a nigga in the room alone with your shorty. You better hope your shorty know how to protect herself. I know when, shoot, when I was in these streets and I had long hair, that was an opening. That was a way to get in. Like, what's up? 
inch. Ooh, buddy. Whoa. Are you okay? Like, are you getting any action? This is small. And you're only 5'6". Are you alright? Here we go with the short man slander. Here we go with the short people slander. What's wrong with being 5'6"? Huh? Now, I ain't gonna lie. Them two inches, I don't know about that. I don't even know why he on the internet telling people he got a two-inch long schlong. Like, come on, son. Two-inch? Bro, this is two... Pause. This about two inches. <laughs> I ain't even finna get into it like that. I just... Some things you just gotta keep to yourself. Hopefully, he's trolling. You know? But at the same time, kings... I told you, if you can't break down the walls of Jericho, my boy, tongue fight that motherfucker to death. Bruh. Bruh. I'm gonna be honest with y'all. Bruh. I don't know what Blueface is doing to these heifers. But I think he may need to write a book. He he may need to come out with some type of tutorial. Because this man just went to jail. She put his whole face on the side of her face. Now, I ain't gonna lie. I do feel as though her elevator don't go all the way to the top floor. We can agree to disagree on that. I'm pretty sure y'all gonna agree with me, though. Her elevator is not going all the way to the top floor. But at the same time, some next chick came out the other day and put the same... Uh, picture with his face, she put on her cheeks. I think she put it on her left cheek. Now, they all can't be crazy, right? Blueface is doing something. I don't even know how to really react to that. I have never really been around a situation. Yes, I have. Yes, I have. Yes, I have. Ooh, I'm going to tell this story. So I have a friend, right? This is in high school. My friend had a girlfriend that he'd been with for four years. While he was with her, he had another girlfriend. Okay? And then he had two more girlfriends. So... This is a small high school, and this man was managing to juggle four relationships. Well, ladies and gentlemen, one day it came crashing down, and they ganged up on my man in the lunchroom. And it was, what's the what's the wrestling? Um, it's Armageddon. It was Armageddon. They ganged up on my boy in the lunchroom, and it was Armageddon. I felt sorry for him, but at the same time now, you make your bed, you got to lay in it. You got to lay in it. I just mind my, my business. I was just on the sideline there for moral support. Now, actually, I'm lying. I did some some whole-ass shit. I went all the way to the other side of the lunchroom because I didn't want nobody asking me no type of questions. Did you know that this was going on? I ain't no shit. I ain't no damn thing. But as an adult, I haven't. I've heard of people getting caught cheating, but not like this. Not being confronted like this. I haven't seen nothing like this as an adult. Not yet. I pray I don't see that, because that's embarrassing. This man don't be. I want problems. I'm ready this one, man. I'm ready this one, man. Oh, this man crazy. It got a little, it got a little, you know, it got a little recoil. It got a little recoil, man. Shout out to her. Hey, you know what's crazy? Hold on. Let me see if I can find her pics.
All right, I did y'all guys a, a solid. I found her page. Um, somebody in the comment section left her at. Let me tell you something, bro. You cannot pop up on video, especially on Instagram and on Facebook, and these folks don't find your at. If she look good, the internet is on it, and they're going to find you. So we found her. We definitely found her. Oh, she Brazilian. Fellas, she's Brazilian. I thought this was some African shit. Hold on, bro. My name is Lua, and I'm the founder of Embraza. I realized that I never actually came here and talked about our vision. You might be thinking that we're just a regular party. Baby, we're not regular. In reality, we're not regular. And she sound like... <laughs> we believe that we are able to empower our... Hey, she sound like this lady I work with. She sound like this lady I work with, bro.